Hi, my name is Peter Diamandis. I'm the founder and executive chairman of the XPRIZE Foundation, the executive founder of Singularity University, and the author of a number of books on exponential technologies. What do you think big business today are not looking closely enough or taking into strategic decision making in order to be successful as they can? I don't think big business realizes the power that entrepreneurs and small businesses have to disrupt them. Uh, today, a small team of individuals using software as a service and AI as a service can come up with new capabilities, new business models that will disrupt old models. So, for example, why didn't uh, Hertz and Avis come up with Uber? Why didn't Hilton and Hyatt come up with Airbnb? Right? The day before something is truly a breakthrough, it's a crazy idea. And large businesses don't look at crazy ideas. They're risk adverse. Well, entrepreneurs have very little to lose. It's not that entrepreneurs are smarter, it's that they're trying more and more crazy ideas faster and faster. Robotic process automation, intelligent automation has been the buzz phrase in the business service industry for the last five years. What do you think is going to transform business services in the next five years? Uh, between 2020 and 25, we're going to see truly the impact of artificial intelligence and machine learning. Many individuals um, from Elon Musk to Sundar, the CEO of Alphabet, uh, to Mark Cuban, to the CEO of IBM have all said uh, what I think I would paraphrase in the following. Uh, in the next decade, we're gonna see two types of companies, those that are fully utilizing AI and those that are bankrupt. Artificial intelligence is going to become so fundamental to the operation of a company, to its success, that it is similar to whether you use the web or email 20 years ago. Uh, companies that are not utilizing AI in full capacity uh, are going to miss the opportunity to truly scale and provide a product or service that is so personalized to the customer that they can't do without it. You speak a lot about being passionate and loving what you do in order to be successful. Uh, how can people love, be passionate about the kind of role even if they aren't in a glamorous one? Um, I think it's critically important that individuals find their massively transformative purpose and pursue it. Uh, and no matter what you're doing, there is a way to do it in a way that is joyful. It's understanding how do you do something 10 times better and if you're in a job, uh, that you truly do not like. It's time to go find another job. Go find something that you love, that you feel uh, uh, that you're adding value to the world, uh, in which you feel you're doing the very best that you can. Um, what are some things that businesses can do today that excite you for the next 12 months? Uh, businesses today need to embrace artificial intelligence and machine learning. I can't say that more strongly enough. They need to look at how do they use software as a service and AI as a service. And one of the things you can do is go and hire an individual, uh, probably someone in their early 20s or early 30s, that understands software as a service, AI as a service, has utilized it, and then comes into your organization and looks at what are those things that you're doing repetitively, those things that could be done by software or AI. Um, and allow the people in your organization to do those things which humans do better, relating to each other, not necessarily you know, uh, doing things in a repetitive or doing things that are dirty, dangerous, or dull.